that the warmer weather is finally upon us, it's time to head outside and fire up that grill. And you are so good at grilling. I do John. like to grill. He does. He's got a mean grill. Well, and here to show us some creative ways to grill is celebrity chef George Duran. Welcome. First off, I, I want to talk about this. Yes, this right? is what so cool. What is right, this right, right. thing? It's called a kukina, actually. It's a, a what? It's a kukina. Kukina. It's a grilling sheet, actually. It's so cool because what it is, it's like a grilling mat that you pretty much open up and you put it on your grill and it creates a non-stick reversible washable reusable surface so that means your asparagus won't fall through anymore you can put fish and it will never stick again and Whoa. you keep the grill clean and you, and you get grill marks too when you cook on it so too. the grill marks come through the kukina right over. where do i get a kukina this is at, genius you get it at all home depots they have it for sale right now it's crazy kukina. amazing it's going to revolutionize the way you cook barbecue let me tell you something i make pancakes on the grill now <laughs> you're kidding and me. i get grill marks on them too but it's this amazing. is the season this is the season Tis so the this season is a great for tool. Kukina. it's fantastic so you cook bacon pancakes you think of it it's never going to fall through anymore so i make something like summer squash my veggies like the asparagus and thin little mm -hmm. things they will never and they, they're not this is so cool isn't that crazy yeah. so with the squash i made it a little tartine like an open face sandwich with ricotta oh, and basil a little can olive oil can we, can we try little, this yeah put a little parmesan a, first on okay. it i'm going to put a little parmesan on this. John, something dish out the parmesan there you go. There. Something simple as that can be made directly on this grilling mat, and you'll never have to worry that you're gonna have it fall through inside. The worst thing is to clean inside the grill. That's the worst. There you go. And this is a great little appetizer while everybody's waiting for the meat to cook and for everything else to be done. You just serve this up and, and you satisfy the hungry people. It's so <laughs> important to get the appetites rolling. Absolutely. You can't yeah. just fill up on the big things. Little by little, have a little bite. Enjoy the spring and enjoy the veggies of the summer. Right. This summer. I mean, this is the way to do it. And then from there, you want to go on the mm -hmm. sweet mm -hmm. note. A lot of people like dessert on the grill and it's mm -hmm. kind of tough. Here's a great idea. Grilled water Watermelon is the big thing right now. I would never think to grow. I would never right? think. I'm wondering if I should even eat it. It caramelizes. Think about it. You grill peaches on the grill. I do. Why not watermelon? Look at this. What's going to happen is the moment I put it on this little grilling mat, this kukina. The kukina. Look at that. You still get kind of grill marks. It gets nice and caramelized. And from there, you can take the watermelon and make a nice watermelon salad with a little feta a cheese. Little feta, a mint. A mint or yes. basil, olive oil. I put some balsamic vinegar in there too. Kind of soup it up a little bit. Not just hamburgers and hot dogs anymore, folks. Yeah, it is. It, to be a little more creative right. and Can also I, using the seasonal things that are out there right now. Absolutely. And again, look, I'm going to remove are all this little squash over here. Oh, and people go. are like, the biggest issue is cleaning the grill. I'm literally going to take a paper towel and just kind of wipe it off. And it just kind of wipes the whole thing off. George, Super this clean. is Ready honestly, this is like revolutionary. That's exactly the word. I'm Wait a minute. Really, no, it really is. Life. Cooking the watermelon does change the let me taste Let me a bit. try it. I'm going right? to try this. Right? It taste, it's almost a reverse back to its squash roots almost. Really? That's a good point. A little sweeter. It's a little bit warm. The warmth actually helps a little bit. Isn't That's that nice? a total different taste. That is delicious. Special. It's very special. And finally, again. Are you going to make us a dessert on yeah, the grill? Yeah, I'm okay. going to have to make a dessert Let's on the grill. It up. It's super easy. I call it grilled, uh, uh, grilled banana split. Uh, kebabs. Okay. What? Very simple. It's so cool, actually. I'm literally going to take some of this um, pineapple, a little cute pound cake in there, okay. some bananas in Ooh, there, and kind of just cake. skewer it up. And the beauty of this <laughs> is that you can throw some maraschino cherries in there, too. And you know what? Make the kids work for their dessert. Totally. They can go ahead and put these on the skewers. Except totally. Don't hit your brother with that. Be no, careful. no, not you at all. Know? Yeah. And you <laughs> literally just kind of just throw it onto the grill, and again, it won't. nothing's going to ever fall through because okay. you have this beautiful grilling mat on top of it. And once it's grilled, you have the gorgeous finish. Product of that here. is beautiful. Isn't it nice? And you guys are going to help me kind of decorate it a little okay. bit. A little chocolate. Oh, I'm going to eat it. Of course, Jill comes in once the dessert cream. is here. Little, little little red whip Here's a red whip right you. over there. Wow. And just go ahead and just kind of just smother all over. Let's go get crazy, yeah. kids. Anything. Let me go, go, go crazy. crazy. Add a little and bit the kids, of caramel. That's it. Beautiful. Isn't oh, you're going to regret that. You don't put it on your squash. Squash? Really? But whip it on squash. This is beautiful, George. in your mouth. That's the way to do it. But you know what? This is so easy and it's a great way to get other people involved. And it's creative. It's not the same thing that you have at your barbecue all the time. So easy to make. Kukina! Kukina, <laughs> awesome. Thank Chef you so George much. Chef George Durant, thank you so much. I'm going to go to Home Depot and get one of these things today. Super, super cool, awesome. Right? Thank you for bringing that to you our bet. attention. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Enjoy the day, right? Absolutely. It's a little gray, so you know what? Go get a Kukina. Yes, exactly. <laughs> thank up. you so much. Here you go, hon. This one's caramel. Thanks, George. Thank you, Jack. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Mm. I'm going to have this.